YouTube channel. Um, this is Sparkit Graphics Training. So today I'll be showing you how to use Canva to design your a birthday flyer using Canva. So without wasting them, we'll move over to our Canva. So you click on Canva. It's showing you how to use Canva to design a birthday flyer. So wait for Canva to load so that you can actually design our birthday flyer. Okay, so I've, you can also use Pixel App to design this, but this is for Canva users and for iPhone users. So now, when Canva actually opens, you have lots of templates, birthday templates, flyer templates, okay, that you can actually work with. So you just choose the best designs, um, the one that suits your test and um, edit. You just go for designs that are actually very easy to edit and work with it. You don't need to go to complex designs. Just look for something simple and work with it. So once Canva actually opens, you just search for bed day. And then you see lots. You see search your content on Canva. So you just tap on it. Okay, you just tap on it. Just tap on it, then you tap on Canva. So we tap on birthday. Tap on birthday. And you search. So we tap on birthday. You see, we have about 45,551 templates on birthday alone. So you tap on see all. You actually be the one to select the ones that you want. You just select the one that you want to edit. So we'll just wait for it to load. Okay. Just scroll and see the one that actually that looks nice to you and you work with it. So we'll just go through all of them. Just go through all of them and uh, choose the one that we like, the one that we want to edit. So, there are lots of big day templates here. There are lots of them. So, you just keep checking. Check for the big day template that is actually very easy to edit and the one that won't really take much of your time. Okay? Let's leave paid. Let's look for the ones that are free so that we can actually work with it. And I did those ones. So. And then we are looking for simple, simple designs to edit. So we just keep looking. You look for something very simple. You don't need to go to something complex. For something simple and edit. Okay. Let's, most of them here yeah, are paid, but let's work with, let's work with this, let's work with this design. So you tap on it, and then you wait for it to load. You wait for it to load. Canva actually takes time, like because of network issues though. So it depends on the level of your network. My network is very poor, so that's why it seems as if it's um taking too much time. So once you decide on the template to use, you can actually keep searching to get the ones that will suit what you want and then you work with it. So wait for it to load so that you can actually edit what you want to edit. Canva takes time. The network is horrible here. So just wait for it to load. So that you can actually edit. Okay. So then once everything is set, all you have your work is just to do what edit your designs and then add the one you want to use. So for the first thing we have to do is so we need to change the date. Okay. The date here is not the same with the ones the one that I want to do. So I'll just tap on edit. Okay, edit the date. 
then I'll use um, July eighteen. 2022 okay so that is the date that i'm using good to go then the next thing is what i'll change the image here i'll change the picture and then i'll use my image so I'll just tap on it and then you wait for gallery to load to so take another time so just wait for gallery to load and then you choose any image that you want and do what and um, attach there so all the images I have here, I've actually removed background from them. But I need image that has a background, so I'll just tap on it. I'll tap on recent. Okay. I'll tap this point. I'll go to... I'll go to where I, I have the image I want to use for my design. And then select that image and use... Can actually use any image for your design, so I'll just select the one I want to use. So I'll just um, scroll to the point where I will select the image I want to use for that for this um, flyer. So I'll use this image for this flyer. So I'll just tap on it. It's one of my old picture, my old picture. I'll just tap on it, and then okay. So you can drag it down. Actually, in that very well. Position it well. Okay. So once we are done with that, once we are done with that, next thing you need to do is what? You need to change this. I don't want to change any right up anymore. I'm okay with the right up. I'm okay with the write up. I don't have anything to write anymore. I'll just work with them. I'll go with what they want me to go with. So the next thing, I think we are done with everything. So we'll just do what? We'll just quickly save. I don't like this design because the uh, my my head is not actually showing very well. Okay, so I can actually crop it. Okay, I can actually crop it. So I'll just bring my head down and I'll tap on done. I'll crop it again, it's not still showing. I'll crop it again. Bring my head down, bring it down. Tap on done. Okay, it's better this way. So the next thing I have to do is what I'm good to go. So I just quickly tap on my, tap on this, then tap on this icon, and then my image will save. So you just give you some time for it to save. So that is actually how you can design any birthday flyer you want on Canva. Just search for a template and you work with it. Okay? Look for something simple and easy to edit so it to not stress you. Then you use it. To do what to edit your design to edit the design, so we just tap on download. So you can actually download our design, so you allow it to prepare. Okay, so really preparing our design for download. Let's download it from here. Tap on download. Let's do it again. Tap on download. Just give you some time. But if your browser is fast, if your network is fast, this will not take much time like this. It will be very, very fast. So just wait for it to prepare so that you can actually download it. So, 
the network is not, it's not really good. So once you're done with that, once you tap on that, your image will be downloaded straight to your gallery. Okay? Thank you very much for watching. See you.